different people, different friends and stuff that maybe had houses or cottages on the lake. We'd go down and spend the afternoon, you know, shoveling snow and, and then skate basically until your toes are frozen. Growing up in Western Canada, Scott Ford always had a place to play hockey. It was just kind of one of those perks, I guess, of growing up in, in Canada and growing up north. You know, we always had outdoor rinks, always had a good group of friends and stuff that you could uh, skate before school or, or after and get a good group of guys, whether you're playing on a sheet of ice or, or playing road hockey or, or on the street or, or wherever, you know, it was always, uh, always entertaining, you know, and the, the parents obviously didn't like it when we smash out the windows. As for organized hockey, Ford says his community had great coaches, including his dad, and Scott had great support from his family in pursuing the sport. So those early morning practices, those early morning drives to the rink when it's, it's like 30 below, 40 below, and you get up and the car is already warm, heated up, and you, you throw your gear on and kind of have a blanket in the car and get, get driven to the rink. And, and uh, it, it, that was awesome, you know. It, it really made you kind of love the game and, and, and want to do it when you have somebody that's really supporting you that much. Casual sports fans might recognize Scott Ford as a guy who occasionally shows up in the highlights, not shooting, but swinging. It's one of those things that's part of the game and I don't mind sticking up for my teammates. And, and I play a physical game too, so when you're in a constant kind of one-on-one -on -one battle against a, an opponent and you're playing physical and it's kind of, you're trying to impose your will against his, to, so to speak, and it happens. You know, it's a, you know, fight breaks out here or there or the odd scuffle and, and you know, I don't back away from it. But Ford says like most players, he doesn't hold a grudge after a fight. Hi, Mom. And if you think Scott is just some thug on the ice, there's much more to him than that. Ford has an Ivy League education, having studied and played at Brown University. I laugh at, at my head's not just a hat rack. I guess, you know, there's, you know, I have something to fall back on and, and I'm very proud of my education. Ford majored in history education. Maybe someday he'll be a teacher in a classroom, but he already has the chance to teach on the ice during his summer hockey school. I really enjoy, you know, seeing the kids and when you teach somebody and, and, you, and you show them um, some skills, whether it's on the ice or off, life skills or, or um, physical attributes to the game and stuff like that, and you see somebody succeed, you know, it kind of it tickles you a little bit. I love to teach and I love to uh, see others succeed as well.